with Thanks, the Biosteel. <laughs> Nike girls futures game at the Biosteel all Canadian event. Team Gray taking on Team Black. Gray took a hold of this one early on. Lemia Hilton takes the high pass, drives, splits the D for a very tough two points. This is Hilton's first year at the all Canadian. Then it's Cheyenne Rowe going to work, cleans up the offensive glass and finishes with the lay in. In transition, Rowe. Driving the lane, let's go of the high floater for two. Team Gray, they led by 16 at the half. Into the second half we go. Black looking for a spark. Jaden Welts comes up with a steal. She feeds it to Emma Cable for the contested layup. Cable finishing with eight points on the night. Then Tanisha Clark uses a gorgeous crossover to get inside and feeds Tiana Todd for a pair. But Roe and Team Gray were just too much, using her distance. She pulls up for the triple, pushing the lead, and she finished with 20 points, leading Team Gray to a very decisive 87-77 victory. Post-game, Roe, with her 20 points, was awarded Team Gray MVP for the game, while Cable's eight were good enough to take home the Team Black MVP trophy.